Okay, this is the test that I did. Uh, if you know, if you notice now, I'm waiting for for the quad to get the the GPS. And next, I'm going to do the the calibration, the hover calibration that is showing on is shown on the B303. You click 12 times, the return to home button, and now it did the calibration of the hover. Okay, now I put my, my battery, close the door. Close the door. Turn on the camera. This is the battery that I have for for the FPB transmitter. Now I take off. If you see, it's flying very stable now after the hovering calibration. It flies stable with the gimbal and everything there. The problem comes if I put the the camera facing down the gimbal with the camera facing down it gets crazy right away. You cannot almost you cannot control the, the quad code the quad the XK. It gets crazy getting and it's very hard to control it. I have to put the camera back again and control it it stays flying like crazy until until like I click the return to home bottom you see is 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 get I am I having problems to control it right there very unstable Then I click the return to home button and it gets stable again. Now if we, I take out the return to home button. If I don't put the camera facing down, it stays perfect. I have no problem with the camera facing to the front. Stay stables and everything there works perfect. Okay, now I'm gonna do another closer look, another test. I take off, the camera is facing to the front, the gimbal works perfect, the edge case very stable, you can fly normal. But now take a look. As soon as I start pointing the the camera down, now you see the quad stars doing the this circle. And now I got I I've stopped the control. I, I try to click the, the, the return to home button, it gets crazy. I put back to manual mode trying to hold it but but it's out of control right now 
is out of control and trying to 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 maneuver but now it, it's going crazy very unstable now click the return to home button again it's trying it's flying away to the right side I think at that at this time that I'm, I was going to lose the quad I put a uh, but in, in over there I click to take out the, the the return to home button put it back again now we got the return to home button he got it there and it's returning home again it's returning stable as I was fighting with it I was putting the the, the pitch of the camera uh, to the front again like the camera facing up to the front and it helps a lot it gets stable right away now after I click return to home it went it came back now if I take the return to home bottom I can maneuver the quad again but the difference now is that the camera is facing forward that's the big problem what I think is that the software of the quad got confused with the with the jaw movement of the of the gimbal if you see now nothing happened very stable like nothing happened and I almost crashed the, the quad if you leave it there it doesn't move Okay, after I did the calibration, you see it flies perfect, very stable, no problem, I can fly the whole battery like that. Uh, but look now, when I start moving the camera, the pitch down, if I try to put the camera to face down, Look, I'm trying, um, looks very stable, flying like new. Now look, I'm, I'm pointing that camera down, nice, it start like turning a little bit, start turning, turning to the left. Now the camera is facing down and then he got crazy. He got crazy. Uh, I get hard time trying to control it. Have to put the camera all the way back, put the return to home try to control it and when they return to home it is I have to put the camera all the way back now the return to home gets get it stable if the camera is, po is pointing to the front it gets stable again as you can see here in the video Now you can fly the quad. Like nothing happened. <laughs> Very weird. 